every little girl dreams of becoming a ballerina, but I actually made my dreams become a reality. When I was invited to go compete at the World Ballet Competition in Europe, I was thrilled. I was so excited, but I didn't know that my life would change forever. What should have been a trip of a lifetime, networking opportunity, chance to compete, travel overseas, turned into a living hell. My coach raped me several times, came into my room throughout the duration of the nine day trip. I was just lucky to make it home. I was merely just a shell of a person. My faith was shattered. But I had a vivid dream that I felt God gave me. I saw an image of a building and written on it said Safe Haven Ballet. I saw both of his hands extended down and in one hand had a pair of point shoes. He told me I wasn't done dancing and in the other hand he was holding a hammer and he said I have things for you to build. Since then I've founded Safe Haven Ballet. It's a nonprofit organization that exists to offer free ballet movement and art classes for survivors of sexual violence and trauma. God has given me courage and has used Safe Haven to help survivors take their lives back, to come out of darkness, to come out of silence, to maybe fight for justice. God is using me in all these ways. It's taught me that you're never too far gone to start again, to start again in your faith from zero. My faith was so strong and so high before going through something extremely traumatic, and I had to rebuild my faith from zero, from zero. And it's still growing. That's faith right there.